Welcome to our lecture online. Our next word problem is one dealing with rate of doing work. And in this case, we have, a, uh, we have John who can paint a garage in eight hours. We have Gary who can do it in six hours and Fred who can do the same job in four hours. How long will it take all three of them if they can paint together? All right, how do we do a problem like that? Let's start out by saying that uh, let T equal the time it takes when they all paint together. Okay, now, if we multiply the rate of each pain, painter times the time that it takes for all three of them to do it together, we add all up, they'll get the whole job done. So the rate of John times the time plus the rate of Fred times the time plus the rate of Gary, well, I kind of mixed it around and I'll put Gary first, plus the rate of Fred times the time is equal to the whole job. So now we have to figure out how fast each painter paints. Well, the rate is the inverse of the total time that it takes for them to paint the garage, which means if John can paint a garage in eight hours, then each hour he gets one-eighth of the garage done. So his rate of painting is one-eighth of a garage for every hour. So the rate for John would be one-eighth and we multiply the times the total time that it takes for the whole garage to be done when they all three paint on it, plus the rate of Gary. If Gary can do the job in six hours, then his rate is one-sixth of a garage every hour, so one-sixth times the time, plus, and Fred can do it in four hours, so his rate is one-fourth. So the faster you can paint, the shorter time that it takes. So one-fourth of, an, of a garage per hour times the time, and all three together we'll get the whole job done like that and all we have to do here is figure out what t is equal to and we know how long it takes for them to paint the garage so here we see that we have three denominators and we're going to have to find the lowest common denominator and it looks like 24 is probably it so we're going to multiply everything by 24 so multiply the left side by 24 and multiply the right side by 24 so 24 24 to get rid of the fractions so 8 goes in 24 3 times, so we have 3t plus 6 goes in 24 4 times, 4t plus 4 goes in 24 6 times, so 6t equals 24. So 4 plus 6 plus 3, that is 13t equals 24. Divide both sides by 13, and we get t is equal to 24 divided by 13, which is slightly less than 2 hours if all 3 of them paint together. And that's how we figure that out. Pretty slick, huh? So all we have to do is just find the rate by simply taking the inverse of how long it takes for them to do it, multiply times the total assumed time t, and then we get the total job done. And that's how we approach that.